Police ultimately shot and killed the shooter, Michael Hans, and there continues to be an outpouring of support for the victims. Last night, students at Copley High School gathered for a vigil. News Channel 5's Deborah Lee attended that service and has more on the emotional reunion. They sang, they cried, they lit candles for their friends whose lives were cut short so tragically Sunday morning. For some of these Copley High School students, life will never be the same. I, I kind of feel like we all have a little bit of closure now, but I'm still never going to be the same without my best friend. Students organized this vigil to support each other as they cope with their loss a loss to an entire community, struggling to resume normalcy for the sake of the children, like these peewee football players practicing tonight under the watchful eyes of their parents. To have a child lost like that would just be awful. Yeah. I couldn't imagine yeah. going through that. And the first thing that came to my mind were my kids. I think what it's going to do, my, me and my daughter were talking, it's going to bring people closer together. You know, mm -hmm. to love one another and, and be considering of each other because life is so short. Oh, Everyone can say a prayer. And we can all say a prayer and then release the balloons at once. Students released dozens of balloons into the air and with them some of their grief, but their memories, fond memories, will always be near. Everybody loved everybody that went and it shouldn't have happened that way. Everybody just happened to be at the wrong place at the wrong time and now we're all here at the right place at the right time.